Hey, what's going on YouTube? UA Reviews here. And today, I've got some new pickups and unboxings that I wanted to do here quickly. Uh, so, I've kind of really already unboxed some of these things. Uh, it was just, I had a bunch of stuff coming in the mail, uh, kind of all at once on different days. And I wasn't going to wait and do an individual unboxing on each thing I got, so I just waited. And mainly, it's just these two things that I'm just going to talk about. But I do have one kind of new pickup. I was at uh, MC Sports not too long ago. And I picked up some... Uh, under Armour Zagger socks. So you may remember these. They're a few years old. They were on sale for $6.97. About $7 for these. And I've never seen them in this colorway. The black and Carolina blue. And if you guys know Carolina blue, the really um, kind of powder blue, however you want to call it, is one of my favorite colors, you know, to kind of match with. And it goes with a lot of my stuff. So uh, I was excited to get those. And uh, hopefully you use them in the future. Train it and Doing all that, but yep, pick those up. But now we'll move on to a package from eBay. So, and we got, I told you guys on uh, Instagram that uh, you wanted to, uh, you know, if anybody wanted to see a review on these, and, uh, you know, I had a good response from people, you know, and I had been asked to do this review uh, a while back. Just because there was no reviews on it. But uh, if you don't know, this is the Cutter SeaTac arm sleeves. And it's kind of hard to tell, but you know, I'll show these and kind of explain them and take them out of the package here. So essentially, what these are from Cutters is they're um, a football kind of, um, I guess you call them a forearm shiver sleeve. And being that they're Cutters, we know Cutters for, you know, having good grip and everything, but the insides of these. Are actually made of the cutter's grip. So what's on their football gloves is essentially here on the um, the forearms. Here's what the kind of outside is. It's kind of like this uh, nice thin compression, so it is pretty breathable there on the outside. And you've got the little, you've got your, you know, stuff you know from cutters. So they come in three different sizes. And I will do a full review on this, but they do come in three sizes. They come in a youth large, small, a medium large, and then a extra large, double extra large. So uh, in the review, I'll explain the sizing. I bought these just for $15 off eBay, and they are normally priced for um, $40. So I got a really good deal on these. Uh, being that I just, I've never really seen, I've seen these in stores before. I'll slip them on here real quick. I've seen these in stores, but I've never really seen a review or heard anything about them. And I have really wanted to know for myself uh, and, you know, know what these are like. So, give me a few weeks. I'll do the review and I'll have that for you guys. So, that's, that's a pretty exciting review I've got coming up. Finally, got some shoes here. And uh, if you're familiar with the... Uh, the stylings on this, I guess you'd say the box, the graphics on the box, you know this is uh, from Brooks. Uh, Brooks, if you don't know, has been making run shoes for a long time. And I uh, got these off East Bay. And first off, East Bay, seriously y'all, I'm tired of getting my shoes in plastic bags, trash bags. And, you know, having my shoes thrown around. I mean, I know they're protected by... I know the shoes are protected by a box. But, you know... When when this box just completely looks like it's been thrown on the road and was dropped several times. It's just... I don't know I don't know if I, to, if I should blame East Bay for this. For, you know, you know packing things kind of poorly. Or, or if I should blame the Postal Service. But you can always blame the Postal Service sometimes. But, you know, those people work hard. Um, East Bay, pack your stuff better. That's beside the point. I've got the new Brooks Transcend running shoes. This is supposed to be one of Brooks' best supportive uh, ultimate ride running shoes. Um, I had a pair of Brooks uh, last year, and I put about 170 or so miles running on those. And... I've already worn these, run, I've run about four miles so far in these shoes, and I've been really, really happy with these. And I have been running a little bit on them, so you can see the red on the track, maybe you can't. Um, they say Brooks down here. I will review these. 
because I think this is a uh, viable review that you know people could enjoy. I know that I'm not really. I do I do review some running shoes from Under Armour, but I will review these just because they are a unique shoe from Brooks. Um, I don't know a whole lot about the technology put into these shoes, so I'm going to spend some time learn about them. I really love the. Uh, I didn't know because really when I was looking at these on the internet. I didn't know really what to think about the color of them. I didn't really know what it'd be like because they only had two colors in them. And I think they're really cool. So hopefully you guys will enjoy that review later on. It'll be on down the line once I you know, have a better assessment of these. So that's going to do it for now. I hope to have some more great pickups in the future. That's all for now. Uh, be sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. That's where you'll find, uh, especially Instagram, you'll find new things that I pick up, uh, news and whatnot. And uh, hope to see you guys back here next time. Thanks for watching.